planet is one of the most deprived areas in the southeast. We frequently reported on the problems with drugs and gang crime which plague the lives of many young people in the area. Now there's a chance for teenagers affected by these issues to get their voices heard with a brand new record label. Arts Education Exchange Records are releasing their first album today, a compilation of tracks written and performed by local young people finding their self-expression through music. Amanda Acas has been to meet them for tonight's special report. All the times you were doing drugs, you were losing love and losing time to live. It's both a warning and a vision for a better future. Life is a gift your mum and dad gave you. 16-year-old Vinnie Oham lived through some dark times during his childhood, but says he was saved by his love of music. My way of escaping that and escaping like the thoughts in my head about what's happened was to rap and you know just to let those emotions like just come out naturally um, other than you know taking it out on violence because I don't want to be that sort of person and I want to teach young people that you don't have to go down the road of drugs. You'll be we can find all this didn't he? Let me He's one of 15 14 to 25 year olds being helped by professional musicians and producers to channel their experiences into music. Today their tracks are being released as an album called Mixtape Number no. 1 via their own record label. Market town, my town, since I was a little kid. The pioneering project's being run by Arts Education Exchange, a creative program designed to support young people in the area. The young people we meet face a range of different challenges. Mental health is a huge issue. Young people who are involved in or at risk of being involved in gang-related activity. Being involved in something that is essentially um, exploring who you are, but also understanding that you are valued by others. We really think that that creates an alternative pathway. Yeah, when I was young, I used to get in, like, I used to go into that stuff when I was young, about 13, 14 when I was, yeah. But now I just don't do that anymore. I just get into my music. No, try to get somewhere in it. Don't just sit down and don't get nothing. Try to get somewhere. Are you excited? Yeah. This is like the first time actually, like, people help me. It's um, an amazing experience, really. Didn't ever think I'd be in a studio in my life. <laughs> All sales from the downloads will be reinvested back into the project, and they're hoping a possible career in music could beckon too. Amanda Acas, BBC South East Today, Margate.